Before we get into today's video, I wanted to quickly thank AOA.com for sponsoring this channel. AOA is a great place to buy all of your Rocket League items, including wheels, crates, keys, and much more. Use coupon code JSPADE to save 3% at checkout. Hello YouTube! It is Jack Ball Spade. I am back again with some more Rocket League. Um, today we're just going to be doing a couple different things. I mean, we've got some pumpkins, we've got some elevation crates, um, we've got some imports for trade-ups, so it'll just kind of be a hodgepodge of those things, but I hope you guys enjoy. Um, I know I didn't get a video up yesterday, and I am sorry about that, but honestly, it is kind of tough to do the daily videos with uh, everything else that's going on in my life. Um, I am not at the point where I can really go full-time YouTube and dedicate all of my time to YouTube, so uh, sometimes it's hard to fit everything in 24 hours, and I, I know that you guys understand, and I really do appreciate your unconditional support, but, um, you know, I've got other things going on too, so um, it will be fun. Um, we've got some shout-outs here, so we'll do that real quick. Or I guess it's just one today. Night Savage 3506. Um, he also wanted me to shout out his Instagram, WBORO underscore warrior23. So thank you so much. I really do appreciate your donation. And uh, we'll get right into it. Um, it looks like the Jawbreaker Crate Theory is still having some issues. Um, my game is glitching out. It won't let me. Uh, uh, move the cursor with my um, left stick, so I'll be using my D-pad, and hopefully that'll be a little quieter. I know that people complain about the uh, the sound of the uh, uh, controller sometimes, so hopefully that'll be better. Um, I think we'll start off with the golden pumpkin, so please do wish me luck, and let's go for it. Uh, we've got exactly seven here, and exactly seven elevations as well. I kind of did that in anticipation of opening seven and two jawbreaker windows, but unfortunately the uh, website's still glitching out. Every time you refresh it goes back to the same time, so I'm really not sure what's going on there, but hopefully they fix it. Um, honestly, these days the jawbreaker crate theory hasn't been doing too amazing for me. I mean. Yeah, I guess it, it did help when we got that uh, white Nimbus and wet paint, but um, I don't know. Uh, when I first started using it, I was all over it, and I thought it was the best thing, and I had a couple really lucky experiences early on, and I think that's kind of what, you know, convinced me to continue doing it, but oh geez, heat wave on the next one. That's rough. And to remind you guys, if you didn't, didn't see that video, we are looking for a black market from a golden pumpkin. I think that's kind of the goal that we have for ourselves right now. So once we get that, we can be happy. But it looks like we're gonna get a forest green endo here. That's really cool. I, I know I'm gonna be tempted to trade that up, but that's awesome that we, we just got that. Unfortunately, I can't rotate it because my left stick's glitching out, but that's, that's great. I am very glad to get a painted endo, uh, I guess exactly halfway through. So that's wonderful. Hopefully we can get some more regular imports. Um, look at, looks like it's gonna be a narwhal here. I know we should have a couple of trade-ups afterwards. And I think, um, yeah, I think we've got some golden pumpkin imports already. So we'll see about that. But yeah, I, I just kind of did want to quickly remind the uh, people who aren't, you know, the hugest fans of my voice or my personality or my appearance or anything. Um, I didn't really anticipate becoming a YouTuber. I didn't really want to have this many eyes on me, and uh, I don't really think that I have that 2018 YouTuber personality. Um, I think a lot of people are very expressive and yell a lot and very over the top, and that's just not kind of how I function, so. Um, it's good to get an import on the last pumpkin there, that's great. Um, I think we'll get right into our elevation crates. No real reason to wait, so hopefully these go well too. Um, I'd say two imports and a couple of very rares from seven pumpkins, that's pretty good. Looks like we're gonna get synthwave here, that is not bad at all. It could be painted, I did see a little bit of lag there. Oh! Oh, wait a second! Oh my god! 
that looks white. I've already got a white synth wave and I know what that looks like. That's amazing. Um, let's just check. Oh, is it not gonna? Of course it won't show me. Okay. Um, we'll go to boosts. Yeah, look at that. Two of them. That's amazing. White synth wave off of the very first crate. Man, that's great. It's not huge, but that's pretty good. I'm very happy with that. I think that's a solid way to start off, and hopefully we can continue with this, but yeah, that's great. Um, honestly, I probably should work on selling at least one or two of those, because um, I, I, I know that you know new boosts uh, tend to outlive their hype really quickly. Um, their prices go down pretty quick, so uh, probably be good to get rid of that soon. But I know people do like the sound that Synthwave makes, so hopefully that'll help me sell it. Um, honestly, I really like that sound too. It's it's really cool. It's like a low, like EDM beat, you know, something like that. Um, it looks like that might be a lime sticker bomb, and it looks certified as well, so that's very cool. Um, if that had been black, that would have been really nice, but I will take it. I will not complain. Oh, those Yamanis could have been painted. I was seeing that lag, too. Honest to God, I am already happy with all my Yamanis. Um, if you guys didn't see that uh, video yesterday, I, I mentioned it like halfway through, so you, you might have not seen if you skipped through the video, but um, I pulled my fifth pair of black Yamanis yesterday. So that was absolutely crazy. Um, I got them from just one uh, rare elevation trade up. Um, it was just really random and casual. I just had it lying around. So I was like, hey, why not? And black Yamanis, $20 item, just like that. So that was amazing. And we're gonna get sky blue right here. Jeez, that is solid. We have been getting some decent painted Yamanes. Um, I know I recently got a crimson one in a really good trade. Um, he traded me a crimson Yamane for a crimson fire plug, the one that I pulled the other day in the big gold pumpkin opening, and an endo. He originally wanted just the fire plug, but he asked for the endo as an ad. And I was like, yeah, sure, you know, you're already giving me a great deal. So that's pretty cool. White Synthwave and Sky Blue Yamane from just seven crates. That is solid. I will totally take that. That's amazing. And uh, yeah, let's go ch quickly check how our Yamanes are doing because we've got, oh, maybe is it? Oh, it's still going by most recent, okay. But yeah, I know we've got um, two black, two purple, one being Victor, one pink, one sky blue, one crimson, and burnt sienna. Yeah, that's solid. I'm pretty happy with that, so let's go for it. Um, let's see. For this one, we will do three pigeon and a unicorn and a treasure. So, wish me luck, and here we go. Oh my goodness, it's gonna give me a white Roadhog. Um, that color would have been nice on Octane. Uh, not sure about a Roadhog, I think I already got that guy. But, that's alright. Uh, let's go back to Alphabetical. And, very rare. Butterfly. Uh... Yeah, I don't know. We'll just do some random ones. Breakout. I think I've actually got a friend looking for painted breakout, so I'll hit him up about that. Um, we can see if we got enough for a uh, non-crate import trade up here. Um, I think we got that Merc in there. Got a Burnt Sienna Merc as well. I uh, got three White Roadhog right now, good lord. Um, and then we'll use that, so please do wish me luck. I've never really gotten anything too great from a non-crate import trade-up, so if it could work out, I would be very, very appreciative. Oh! Man! That's decent, I'm pretty sure. Um, I, I do not know that much about the uh, non-crate exotic market, but I'm pretty sure 
exotic white tunicas are worth something. Um, that's solid. That, that's so funny, you know, we're gonna get the uh, white dicies the other day and now white tunicas. And I guess we got the white sunbursts as well. Jeez, well that's a lot of white non-crate exotics. Um, I'd say that's solid. I'm pretty happy with that. So, uh, I think that's probably gonna be it. I don't have too much more that I can trade up right now. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, I know that there weren't really any single insane pulls, but I just kind of wanted to do a quick video. Um, I should have mentioned this earlier, but I am currently working on a gameplay montage, so we will have some gameplay very soon, and uh, I know that you guys have been asking for that. So, thank you guys for, for the support, as always, and uh, stay tuned in, and I will catch you guys on the next one.